What's up, booze? What it do? What it do? Welcome to A Nicole Tarot. I am your girl, A Nicole. And I am here to do a general reading for the collective. So come on in, everybody. Again, I thank you all for tuning in to A Nicole Tarot. Mm, somebody is obsessed with y'all. Somebody or uh, somebody obsessed with somebody. Let's see what that is. Well, that came out first. Um I want to let you all know or remind you all that this is a general reading. It's not a one-to-one. -one. So take what resonates, leave what don't. If it does not fit you or don't sound like your situation, please don't try to force it. Okay? This is a general reading. I'm not just um, pulling on your energy. Okay? Um, please be aware of people out here acting like they are me. I'm not doing readings right now. So if somebody approaches you about a reading, especially tells you to cash at them or whatever the fuck they out here saying, go ahead and curse their asses out. Report them and block them. Okay? I've already cleansed the space. I've already opened the roads. And I've already um, pre-shuffled the deck. So we can go ahead and get started. Um, thank y'all so much for y'all's likes, y'all shares. Thank you so much for commenting. Thank you so much for the word of mouth. Thank y'all so much. A special thank you for if you've ever left me a tip. You know, PayPal, Cash App, whatever. You know, pain is next. Um, thank y'all so much for the support. So without further ado, let's get into today's reading. First on the docket, we have obsession. It says infatuation, adoration, addiction. Someone could be obsessed with you. Somebody could be addicted to you or adore you, or this could be you with them. But then we have pain here. Okay. Apprehensive, afraid, cautious. Hmm. Some of you could be obsessed with someone or you could be infatuated someone with someone, but you could be afraid that they may cause you some sort of pain. You may be cautious. You may have been hurt before. Hmm. Okay. Tell me more. Tell me more about this energy spirit. Tell me more about this energy. Thank you. Elusive. Dishonesty, deception, trickery, mm, hopeless, sinking, despair, falling apart. So, hmm, this could be somebody who's caused you pain. You know, this is somebody who has caused you a lot of heartbreak, you know, with their dishonesty, with their deception, with their trickery, you know, and this could be a hopeless ass motherfucker, you know, whose life is just falling the fuck apart, particularly probably after you all have headed the fuck on out. Hmm. Tell me more about this energy and maybe that you all have headed the fuck on out and now you are elusive to them just like they were elusive to you with their feelings. This person is obsessed over you. They're watching you because they remember that you were the loyal one. They remember that they could trust you. You were the reliable one. You were the one who was believable. They were the, the liar, the elusive one the one that caused the pain in the relationship hmm. this could even be someone who maybe you were obsessed with both you know at some point you were very 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 um uh infatuated with this person you could have been addicted to this person particularly the sex may have been addictive take it as it resonates hmm Tell me more about this energy spirit, please. Tell me more. Thank you. I'm going to take that. Spying. I'm telling you, this person is spying on you. Because I feel like this person is obsessed with you. This person is obsessed with your move on. This person is obsessed with what you're doing right now. How everything. Because for a lot of you, you could be not speaking to this person. You know, you put this motherfucker on ice, I'm hearing. You know, you have no words for this person. It's a stone wall. It's like they could be talking to a fucking wall because you ain't talking back. You don't have shit for this person. And it has a lot to do with the fucking, the pain that they've caused you. You know, all of the pain that they've caused you, all of the lies, you know, all of the deception and all of that shit. You don't have no words. You didn't ice them the fuck out. Clinging, but they holding on to you. They're spying. This person is spying on you. This person is watching you. Hmm. Holding on. They, they're holding on to you. Because wasn't nobody like you, I'm here. And I, I'm looking at this loyalty card. 
you know, they you were their best friend. You was that man's best friend or that one man's best friend. Hmm. Now they hopeless. That motherfucker starving. I'm hearing. Some of y'all person, they ain't motherfucking eating, they ain't showering, they ain't coming to work. They looking real fuck up. Hmm. Thank you, spirit. What's this? Distracted. Hmm. Sidetracked. Change. Delays. Running. Ghosting. Disappearing. In invisible. Ever since y'all done rolled out on them, ever since y'all done motherfucking made them changes, you know, and you done ran off and you done rolled out on them, this person been falling apart. Okay? Because you've realized that the cycle has closed. The chapter has closed. You know, you're not waiting for them to be a better person anymore. You're not waiting for them to get their shit together anymore. A lot of you all are seeing that whoever this energy is, they motherfucking hopeless as a penny with a fucking hole in it. Okay? Resistance. Some of you could have been resistant to that fact. Some of you all could have been resistant to the fact that this was not your person. And this could also be that person being resistant to the fact that you're moving the fuck on. You're moving the fuck on and you're healing. You're releasing this person. Time is up. A lot of you all have been cleansing. A lot of you all have been purifying your energy. Some of you could be doing, you know, your spiritual bath, your cleansing baths. Um, you all could be saging. Um, I'm also hearing some of y'all been steaming uh, yoni. <laughs> a lot of you all have really been resetting your energy, moving the fuck on, cutting cords and all of that. Cutting cords from this divine masculine. This person is hope is hopeless, shocking, and escaping. A lot of them are shocked that you have rolled out on their asses. A lot of them are shocked that their time has ran out, that you have escaped. They are shocked. A lot of them, especially if you block this person, you changed your number, you just cut off all contact, just cold, just frozen. You have them at this, this stone wall. They are very much so surprised. It took them by fucking surprise because, remember, you man's best friend and you one man's best friend. You're supposed to be loyal to the end. No matter how much a motherfucker uh, stick a fucking knife in your back. Confessions. But this person wants to come clean to you. This person wants to come clean to you. This dog-ass motherfucker. They want to come clean to you. They want to unveil some shit. They want to confess some shit to you. Let's see. Thank you, spirit. What else do we have? Have anything else this situation bluff okay because i feel like this person you called their bluff this person has also been fucking wearing a mask this whole time and they want to make some confessions or maybe some shit came to the light about the mask that this person was wearing you could have thought that this motherfucker was loyal you could have thought that you could have trusted this person you could have thought that you could have believed this person and come to find out this is a dog ass motherfucker who was wearing a motherfucking clown mask this who you thought you had you know a nice loyal little lab lab and when the fucking lights came on this is what you had a motherfucking clown okay bluff it was a big unveiling, and the, and the unveiling was this person was not loyal. Mm -mm. This person was not on the up and up. But this person is watching you, and if, you know what? Because I say you can mix the, um, the energy. I hope this ain't y'all watching this person. But this person could be watching you. This person is spying on you. They can't let you go, especially if you or you're, bleh, you're glowing up. You know, if you have, if you're dating, if you're whatever, this person is watching you, okay, past life. This could be something um, that was a karmic lesson for you. This could be something that's deja vu. You could have felt like you've dealt with this situation before with someone else. You know, you could have recognized also the repeated patterns, the common denominator in this union. You know, you may have had this issue with other people before. Hmm. And, uh, and with past life, this could also be somebody... Who you've known from a past life, a karmic. Any of that. Thank you, spirit. What else we got? Chasing. Now this person want to chase you. Yeah, now this person wants to pursue you and all their toxicity. They're going to be resilient and they toxicity. They want to chase you. They want to stop running and now they want to chase you. This could be a twin flame intuition some of you all may have um intuitively known um this already spirit may have already told you everything that i'm telling you already 
you know because a lot of you have um an inner knowing a lot of you all are very intuitive and spirit is also saying to draw on your intuition in this situation because this person is also uh, using telepathy to get you to come back to them this person is literally manifesting you back they're there they want to pursue you they're wishing on a motherfucking star to get you back into um their their, their grips their claws their talons they want to tug at your motherfucking heartstrings and shit like that make you feel sorry for them okay because they feel real rejected right now they feel real abandoned dismissed a lot of y'all dismissed these motherfuckers and was like off with your motherfucking head because y'all got clarity something happened with this unveiling where you go unveiling i just had the unveiling hmm. Hmm. This thing has some, here it is something happened you learned something something was unveiled something you got a, mes a message something coming clean or something but y'all the, the point is y'all got clarity now Y'all got clarity that you, 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 you didn't have before. And that clarity may have caused you to just dismiss this person. Reject them. Get the fuck out of here. And now a lot of you all are on this energy of nourishing yourself. Healing. Self-growth. Self-healing. What is this? Self-finding. You know, a lot of you all are spending time to yourself. Taking nice little baths. I said spiritual baths. You know, sipping you a nice little wine, you know, a glass of wine, a little glass of Prosecco, you know, whatever your vice is, you know, whatever gets you popping. Open heart. Okay. A lot of you all are very empathetic. A lot of you all are very receptive. A lot of you all are, are <sighs> light workers, empaths. And because of that, you're very vulnerable to motherfucking energy vampires. You're very vulnerable to people who see your open heart as open season, you know, to just rain all their motherfucking terror down on you hmm. and, and cause you a lot of pain. Trapped, stuck, tied down, captive. A lot of people like to tie you down. They see your aura, your energy, this open heart, all that you have to give and they want to tie you down. They don't want to do right necessarily. Absolutely the fuck not. But they don't want you to go and 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 take that show on the road and get and go entertain somebody else with it. Ain't that a bitch? If these messages are resonating, don't forget to go ahead and give me that likes up, that thumbs up, give the video a thumbs up below. I appreciate in advance. What else do we have, spirit? What else do we have, spirit? On this energy soulmate, shit, fantasy. Yeah, this was a, a deep love connection. I'm talking to someone about a deep love, some sort of a big connection. You could have thought that this person was your soulmate. And spirit is saying that was a motherfucking fantasy. You was daydreaming. You was imagining. You was fantasizing. This was not your fucking soulmate. Okay? Because no. This person did nothing but disrespect your boundaries. You know, you had to draw the line. Enough is a fucking enough. This person was out here brawling. This motherfucker was out here. I'm hearing... Uh, running that motherfucking relationship like Suge did Death Row Records. You know, you had to put up some really big boundaries, some big barbed wire for this energy because no mas, no more, no more hurt, no more mask wearing, you know, no more motherfucking uh, 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 doing shit behind your back, betraying you, lying, deceit, all of that is done. And for a lot of y'all, y'all not obsessed about this person anymore. And I feel like this person could have thought that they could do all of the fucked up shit that they did to you because you're so obsessed with them. Because you're so infatuated with them. Because oh I'm hearing Nick's boo ain't gonna never leave. Oh, I got I got I got her or him wrapped around my finger. I got them wrapped. Oh no, nah, they ain't never gonna leave me. They in love with me. Uh-uh. They 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 worship the ground I fucking walk on. Hmm. How's that going for them right now? Now they, they crying tears of a fucking clown. Okay? <sighs> I'm going to leave it here, y'all. I hope these messages have resonated with you. Um, if so, again, I ask that you give the channel a subscribe. Go ahead and join the Nicole Tarot family. Come on through, boo. And also like the video. It really helps the channel and the algorithm. It makes me feel all warm and fuzzy inside, huh? 
um let's see i will leave all of my information below with how to connect with me off of here okay in the meantime in between time please know that i am rooting for you i love you you know i always want you to be fuck shit free and i'm always here to provide that space just for that because that's how i live my life fuck shit free okay um and yeah i will catch you all next time thank you thank you so much for giving me your time and tuning in to a nicole tarot particularly if you watch this all the way to the end because i hear some people don't watch reasons all the way to the end i'll be like uh, um but thank y'all so much i love y'all fuck with y'all i rock with y'all until next time thank you for tuning in to a nicole tarot i'm your girl a nicole i'll catch you next time bye